and it says what? 41 minutes! Today was a really good day! Good morning. It is our first day of nursing school, second semester. It is so hard to get up right now. It's currently, God, it's eight o'clock in the morning. GPS currently says it will take me 38 minutes, 38 minutes to get to school. So I think I could do it. Okay, in my car now, holy crap. I'm a little late. Um, it's currently 8.28 right now. And, um, yeah, it, it says it's gonna take me, it said it's gonna take me 42 minutes to get there. I don't have, you know what, I'm just gonna hold, hold you guys. I feel like our start is a little rough today. It says it's gonna take me 42 minutes to get to Sam's house. Um, this semester we're doing OB and Pete's and it's gonna be exciting, yeah. The thing that sucks right now is that having class at 9.30 a.m. is not that great. Yes, you can sleep later, but the commute, the traffic is way worse. So I would actually much rather wake up earlier and have really good non-traffic. Oh great. There we go, backed up, backed up right here at the start. Great, I'm gonna show you guys right now. Look at that, yay, woohoo, backed up. And it says what, 41 minutes? And I still need to go to Sam's house. You know, like people don't know how to merge. I'm on a freeway ramp merging onto the freeway and just people don't know how to freaking do that. This might be a long video. I think I'm just gonna catch you guys when I am there or maybe I'll catch you guys when I'm at Sam's house. Who knows? But we have 40 minutes to just like think. All right, just picked up Sam's papers and I have 10 minutes to get to school and it looks like I'll be there right on time, which is awesome. Well regarded, very well recommended. I have not met her personally, but I think she will end up being great for you guys. For you guys, right? My mm -hmm. people. Okay. It's a confusing class from the very beginning. I totally get that. You're like, what is going on with these emails and the announcements? Alright guys, back in the car. Um, oh, let me just turn this off. It's so loud. Um, today was a really good day. Yeah. Today was such a good day. Oh my god. Let's see if I can put you guys right there. Okay, today was a really, really good day. Um, my teacher is so freaking nice. She's so sweet. What a difference from last semester. I high key wish I did film last semester and you guys know what I went through because it was pain and horrors. But um, uh, yeah, we started off with just like questions, you know, like she asked us if we had any questions and the questions went on for like a good like 40 minutes because she answered everything so, so thoroughly and she was, oh, I loved it. I loved it. I love how teachers, I love certain teachers who make sure you are heard. Like if you ask a question, like if you ask a question, here, let me put on the GPS. All right, guys. And now we are off. I really want to get some boba right now. I don't know. Today was such a good day. I, do you guys see me better like this? Okay, I'll take off my glasses. But, um, so I have a really good feeling about the semester. But yeah, uh, when I get home right now, I'm gonna eat and then kind of set up my, um, schedule agenda for today it was a rough start at the beginning but it was awesome so yeah i will catch you guys later when i get back home okay what's up guys i am home now so i wanted boba 
and the plaza that I entered had a Taco Bell and I've been really craving their soft tacos so I didn't get boba I got four soft tacos and a Baja Blast eating break um listen to kayla kasuga's and maddie brunch's new podcast i love kayla kasuga she's like my fave youtuber so um yeah she came out with a new podcast like a month ago and i listen to it every tuesday so it just came out right now it's currently one o'clock so i'm gonna listen to it while i eat my taco bell or watch some youtube videos but yeah so what i have written down is i have to listen to my online lecture that's recorded um some lab modules look at literally look at all those lab modules let's do this friday i have to do all of them um my little intro video i just literally need to introduce myself and just practice math because we have a math quiz next wednesday and yeah that is the current plan um so before we continue on with this video, I just want to thank Maiden for sending me a backpack. They are a really successful top selling backpack company on Amazon. This video is not sponsored. I'm just going to do a quick honest review. It's still in its package so you guys will get my raw and honest reaction to this backpack. So let's just go ahead and open it. Oh great, I cut myself open. Look at that. Look guys, be careful when you open boxes, please. Ouchies. Here is the backpack. It has a new backpack smell. Wow, it's huge. It's such a nice backpack. Look, it's honestly like big enough. If you wanna go camping, you could totally take this backpack too. It's a lunch backpack combo so um, in the picture this front pocket is where you pack your lunch so let's see let's open it and yeah oh my goodness look at that in the front there's a huge pocket to put your lunch in so you don't have to um, you don't have to have a separate lunch bag so that's pretty awesome there's also another pocket right here in the front so you can put like your pens pencils in there and then there's this big gigantic pocket and this is where you can charge your phone or whatever there's a usb port right here and there's a connector so you connect so you can connect your portable battery so that's pretty cool this backpack is actually super huge so there's another zipper behind this pocket and this is where you can hold your laptop you see I actually love all the space. Um, if you want to get 10% off on any backpacks if you buy off of Amazon, Maiden backpacks, you can use my discount code Tiffany Huynh. I'll put it right here or on the bottom. Um, you can use Tiffany Huynh to get 10% off and I'll leave the link in the description and all the, that information in the description. But yes, thank you Maiden for sending me this backpack. I love it so much and it's perfect for any student going back to school. Take a nap. I think I need one. The commission has pointed out that communication is one of the issues that they identify when they look at the root cause. Michael is making me spaghetti right now, so mm, I'm excited. I woke up like an hour ago and I started this lecture, this 48 minute lecture, and I'm only 20 minutes in. I have a problem with pausing and writing and then playing and then pausing and writing like every other second so these online recorded lectures aren't really like the greatest you know it's like great because you get down everything but it's gonna take like a way longer if you're a no taker just like me hey, you like this one or the other one? <gasps> that one thanks mommy <gasps> say hi babe this is michael 
This is my boot thing. What's this for? What's this for? Yeah. What do you mean? What's this business video for? My friends. What's my friends on the YouTube. What's up, YouTube friends? <laughs> like it. What a great boyfriend. Oh. Alright, I'll catch you guys later when I finish this lecture and I finish this bowl of spaghetti. Just showered. Feeling fresh and clean. Mm -hmm. Michael is getting ready for work right now. He works the night shift, so. Mm -hmm. We're gonna say goodbye to Mikael. Bye. You guys like my pajamas? I got this from Walmart. It's camping, look at the trailer. It's just super cute. There's like a little trailer, a little camping stuff, and it says glamping and s'mores and stuff. So. We have orientation at our hospital for clinicals at um, 7.45 in the morning. So I have to wake up like at 6, 6 at the latest. Get ready and try to leave by, try to leave by like 6.50. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. Okay, I'll catch you guys later. Yes. <laughs> hey everybody, it is the next day and I just got out of clinical as you can tell. Let me cover my badge. Um I'm in my scrubs. It's freaking hot in my car, but um yeah. So, but today it was just an orientation day. I will tell you guys more about it when I get home because I'm freaking starving and it's hot in my car, so I wanna get home. But today was an easy, normal day. It was just like orienting to the hospital. So, yeah, we actually start um, next week on Thursday, I believe, next Thursday, on the actual labor and delivery floor. But as of right now, we're still like trying to get our badges and everything. But I'll tell you guys more about it later. Home now with some spaghetti. So today, the first thing we did was we did our N95 fit mask testing, which I don't know, it was a little sus because the, the the air that they sprayed into our big old mask thing that we had to wear, it was so subtle. Even before we put the mask on, after that we went down to take our pictures for our badges and then uh, then we did EPIC training. EPIC is like the system that almost every hospital uses to chart. So um, yeah, today was a normal day. After that, we kind of just talked a little bit. She just explained what we could see. Um, our goal is to see uh, one vaginal birth this semester, one C-section. Um, after I eat, I'm just gonna work on the online modules that I showed you guys yesterday and just extra homework like I'm just gonna study and read and stuff so that's basically all of this week if you guys watched till the end of this video thank you so much mwah, mwah, mwah. thank you I love you if you guys want to keep tabs on me I post very frequently on my Instagram so go to my Instagram it's underscore tiff honey if you guys aren't subscribed make sure to subscribe let's grow this channel and just freaking make this family bigger, you know? But anyway, I'll, I'll catch you guys in my next video, okay? Bye, guys.